Been waiting a long time for this, the CZ600 Trail 300 Blackout. We are using Let's use that for bloopers. Yeah, we are. We are. We're using SMB, my boys, my check boys, SMB, 300 Blackout, 200 grain, subsonic. Hey everyone, James Reeves, TFB TV here at the CZ factory in the Czech Republic with my good buddy Carl. We are looking at a variant of the CZ 600 trail that I have been waiting for for a really long time. Carl can sense the aggravation in my voice because the CZ 600 trail, you guys introduced it at IWA 2022. I was yep. there with our boy Andrew. We ran over the lineup and the one I was the most pumped about was the trail, which is this model we're gonna talk about in just a second, yep. in 300 Blackout, because 300 Blackout in a bolt action is the tits. Dude, that's silly. That is hilarious, that is so quiet, like no ears. I remember when they were zeroing it earlier, and I kept hearing like a cling, like down range, but I'm like, what are they doing? Like, are they hitting that, that target with a hammer? Yeah, it's quiet. You've got no action noise. You put a suppressor on it. Everything goes yeah. down the barrel. Yeah. Oh, and I was so and excited. It was there. So, and it, yeah, and, and, and we still don't have it in the United States as we sit here, True. October 2023. We still don't have one in the United States, but it's coming. Is that right? Right. Yeah, that's right. We introduced it this year, 2023. Uh, I have it in my hands. This is one of the prototypes uh, mm -hmm. of the CZ600 Trail in 300 Blackout. If I don't know what the CZ600 trail is, I kind of just went over it briefly, right. but let's talk about the features. Let's talk about the CZ600 family. What is the CZ600? Right. Uh, CZ600 is a family of uh, bolt action rifles from CZ. There are different types, different variants. They are focused on target shooting and hunting. And CZ600 trail is kind of like uh, stepping aside from the family because it has different controls. It, it looks different. Uh, it's just, yeah, the young uh, little brother of the family. Right, sure, because all the other CZ600 models are like precision, hunting, sporting yes. oriented, yes. where this one is more geared towards self-defense or to have something lightweight you can take with right. you on a hike, right. you know, exactly. not necessarily like hunting. Exactly, so um, it can, it's basically capable of whatever you want it to be. It's, mm -hmm. It can be a fun gun for a shooting range. It can be a gun you attach on your backpack for a couple of days of hiking uh, when you, might be uh, also do hunting or you need a self-protection. So yeah, it's capable of whatever you want. And we also wanted to be, uh, we also wanted to present something uh, for the markets where semi-automatic rifles like Brand 2 are uh, unfortunately banned. So with a bolt action, uh, people can buy stuff like this. And the neat thing about the trail is the magazine compatibility, Stanag magazines, exactly. like AR-15. So Stanag magazines, we have uh, AR-15 grips uh, in here. We have uh, controls from brand two. So it gives you the feeling of the semi-automatic gun in a bolt, pack, a bolt action package. Right, and it's lightweight and it's compact, mainly because of the adjustable stock. And we exactly. can work through the features here. So we got this collapsible stock. Yes, Right. so three we have position. a collapsible stop with three positions, uh, all the way retract. Uh, as I said, uh, we have the grip with replaceable back straps, ambidextrous safety, ambidextrous uh, release for the magazine. Uh, the whole family of CZ600 has adjustable trigger. Uh, the CZ600 Trail is the only one with double stage trigger and can be easily adjusted by turning this uh, button in the trigger guard. Which I think is a really neat feature. Like I can just easily yeah. adjust the trigger weight myself. Yeah. Don't have to be a gunsmith. I just exactly. use a, a tool. A and it starts off at what, like around two pounds so or something? The, yeah, yeah, it's um, 850 grams. That's the first setting, the, the lightest. And that's something like a slowly, uh, a bit, little bit less than two pounds. Right, and then it goes up in 250 grams? 250 increments. grams, yeah. So that would be like a half a pound. Right, so yeah. you can, you can take the trigger weight up if you yeah, want. Yeah, exactly. Up to like 1,500 gr uh, grams. <laughs> right. Uh, bolt, very short throw, especially yep. because this is based on, I mean, what, it's going to be 
300 blackout, 556, and maybe 76239. Yes, yes. yes. those so, are the calibers that, uh, that are available for CZ600. Right, so the action is super short, super mm -hmm. fast, and actually really smooth, you yeah. know, which yeah, is yeah, yeah. one thing that I like about it. That is so dumb. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Got the full length optics rail. Yes, on exactly. That's uh, one inbuilt because it's made from one piece. It's not a rail attached to the receiver, but it's a uh, monolithic built into the receiver. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. And then you've got like the handguard with the handguard with the M block, so you can attach various types of uh, accessories like the QDs, for example. And we didn't go over uh, the fact that you've got uh, the yeah the you've got the sling yeah. swivel on the back or the exactly. uh, QD sling point QD in the back, point. and you've got the cheek uh, cheek yes. piece right and. This one is not, I can't just flip it over, right? I got to get a no. different one if I'm left-handed. Uh, no, fortunately, you cannot. You, ha you would have to get another one. Talk to me about the barrel because we did a factory tour mm -hmm. and I saw the cold hammer forging process and the barrel manufacturing that you guys all do on site yes. here and the attention to detail is amazing. Talk to me about CZ600 trail barrel. So uh, with the whole CZ600 family, it's actually the first rifle we ever manufactured with locking mechanism incorporated into the barrel. So we have to mill uh, the compartment, the space before the chamber, uh, so we're able to put the locking locks there from the bolt. So the bolt is directly locked into the barrel, not into the receiver. So this is the CZ600 barrel. And what we did is that we now have locking into the barrel. In the previous, with previous rifles, what we were manufacturing, there was always locking of the bolt done into the receiver and then there was barrel screwed on it. Now we make the locking locks directly in the barrel, which of course improves the whole system, improves the accuracy and also safety. It's all one piece now. Yes. Now, Very cool. Now it's, when you put the bolt in it, lock it, it's all in one piece. Right. And that's a really neat feature. You get great accuracy. I Absolutely. know that you guys have accuracy guarantees for the different models of 600 mm -hmm. Trail. I don't know. I remember this one being like a little bit, you know, they're, they're reluctant to make a recommendation in terms of, yes. or, or a guarantee for accuracy because 300 blackout, not inherently accurate. Mm, You're mm. using all different types of mil spec ammo and such. I remember that the guarantee for the uh, CZ600 trail was uh, two MOA. Mm -hmm. And when I asked our product manager, they said it's mainly because of the stock, which doesn't really give you the 100% yeah, support. Yeah. It's one of the compromises you do with the telescopic stocks. So it's definitely capable of, of better accuracy than yeah, that. Yeah, because I mean, it's got at, at, at its heart, it has the 600, the CZ600 series barrel, which is incredibly accurate. Yes. Yeah, and then the barrel threading. So mm -hmm. of course, the best part about having 300 blackout, being able to use a suppressor, exactly. you again, send everything down range. So it's super quiet. I believe you guys are doing 5.8 by 24. Yes. Yeah, for the 300 yes, blackout. Exactly. So I can put a suppressor on there now. Tricky question, mm -hmm. this is going to be 16 inch, I imagine, coming to yes. the United States, because it has to be. So one thing I want to mention, as we were speaking about suppressed shooting, the barrel thread is a one in seven, which is perfect for a subsonic ammunition shooting. Can I get a nine inch version of the barrel? Uh, because we just released that, so it's not available at the moment, but I believe that in the future we, we will work on that. Uh -huh. because, yeah, I mean, yeah. it'd be if, if there is a demand, we always want to, want to fulfill the requirements from our customers so yeah we will take that under consideration and it would look really cool and it, it really speaks to the heart of what the trail is right like you would get a yeah, e even lighter even more compact so i think that'd be neat because you know everybody kind of agrees that nine inch is like the sweet spot for 300 mm -hmm, blackout mm -hmm. now caliber exchanging so i i right. know that with the trail originally there was a conversation about whether or not you mm -hmm. can change the barrels this would be neat in 300 blackout because all you have to do is a barrel swap True. and your 556 300 blackout is it going to be possible uh so as with the rest of the family it was uh developed uh on the ground of the barrel swap possibility uh it is possible so the system allows it but you, according to the cz policy you need to uh do that by the certified gunsmith Otherwise, you lose your warranty, but it's possible. There are a lot of people that are going to be a lot more attracted to this if they know they can go between yeah. 556 and 300 That's blackout. True. Now, finally, I've been waiting forever for this frigging gun to show up in the United States. Do we know when that's actually going to happen? Um, we don't know yet, 
because it always takes time. Uh, as I said, it has just has been released, but I believe that by the end of the year, we can see the first samples over there. Price should be about the same as the 556, I, I would so. imagine. I mean, it's just a barrel difference, that's it, right? I believe so. Uh, I cannot really guarantee that. I, I don't really oh, know. Oh, sure. Uh, who knows? I mean, I know. We're just talking. We've got a prototype gun. Where exactly. We don't know when it's going to be released. And I'm appreciative that you're willing to speak with me on camera mm -hmm. about it. Again, because, you know, you're holding a prototype. Not everything's concrete. So, Carl, thank you right. so much for speaking with me about the CZ600 no Trail 300 Blackout. Super excited about it. I know they are, too. Guys, stay tuned. We're bringing you more from CZ in the Czech Republic.